Work, sleep, death. A little grim. A little boring is what it is. Catwoman. Hey, money man. I'm just curious if you... Yes? If you missed me. John is right downstairs. Yes or no? Answer the question. <sighs> Not one bit. How'd you and Riddler first meet? You know, I do a lot of... freelance work. Let me guess, Riddler wanted a painting from the Louvre? <laughs> Without bragging too much, it was an easy job. Huh. After all, I'd already robbed the place twice. He became a valuable contact when money was tight. So why are you really here? I said I'd tell you when we're alone. We're not. I'll tell you later. Canned food. And lots of it. We can't all get lobster thermidor on a whim. Riddler's bed couldn't look less comfortable if he tried. A pair of Riddler's shoes. He didn't exactly have great fashion sense. Well, he did say something about a foot. I take you by night, by day take you back. None suffer to have me, but do from my lack. <laughs> that sounds positive. Sure proud of his exploits, wasn't he? John, we're friends, right? So I gotta ask, what do you see in Harley? A ruthlessness. The way her accent comes and goes when she's mad. The way she lets things escalate into violence. <laughs> I I've been meaning to ask you. The green hair, what, what, is, what is that? I don't know, what's with your black hair? I'm sorry, Bonnie. I'm a little sensitive about my style. Well, didn't mean to make you uncomfortable. I don't remember anything about myself before Arkham, and when I came to... Well, here it was. I guess it's natural. Why do you hate Riddler so much? I've mentioned this before, but uh, he always interrupted me! Never let me get to the punchline. It takes a lot of confidence to tell a joke, you know? It made me look like an idiot! In front of Harley. Those other guys. Well, hey, uh... I guess I have the last laugh now.
Tesla coils. This whole place is an electrical death cage. If these start sending out energy, we'll all fry. This is where he built his boxes. That's odd. This is my city. This is my plan. Nobody will interfere. Oh, goody. It looks like you've got both feet in the grave. You hear that? It's like you're standing on an elevator. I bet whatever we're looking for is down there. Maybe someone should stay up here. Keep watch. Good point. Let's go, Bruce. Sorry, cat lady. Or maybe you could stay? Oh no, Harley gave me an assignment and I mean to fulfill it. Uh, John, could you give us a moment? Uh, oh, <laughs> yeah, gotcha. Something. Charming and unnerving at the same time. So, now that we have a moment, care to fill me in? Care to tell me the real reason you're doing this? Out with it, Bruce. What's going on? I'm undercover. For yourself? <laughs> Isn't Bruce Wayne kind of always undercover? Or is it the other way around? No, yes, I'm undercover working with a group called the Agency. Let me get this straight. You're partnered up with someone? I hope they meet your high moral standards. I didn't come back to Gotham to start up this dance again. But seeing as how both our lives are on the line, let's try to be professional. We can work together. For now. If we have to. You can relax. This is only business. We're here to find the black side, remember? Good. Great, actually. Thank you. Now it's my turn. Why are you here? You're not really in bed with this... pact. And what if I am? Maybe I need the money. Maybe I don't. Who knows? The world's a complicated place. You're better than that. You once told me I was nothing more than a thief. So this is... surprising. Yoo-hoo! Can you two get a move on? Playing guard is getting pretty boring. Just another minute. We've got it under control, John. Fine. But we've got a job to do, remember? Let's just see what this is all about. This might hold the black side location. Oh, not a typical on button.
Didn't Riddler carry one of these in Europe? He did, but they were purely aesthetic. Must be something nearby we can use. You think it might be a trap? Maybe. But we already made it past the line of security, so maybe not. Your certainty is assuring. USB drive. Here we go. Decryptor detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Project Lotus. Sanctus. Retinal scan required. Shit. I haven't made the goggles yet. Retinal scan. Time out. Hephaestus protocol enacted. The decryptor! You know what Sanctus is, don't you? I heard stories on jobs. Best I can piece together, they're a group up to... No good is generous. They're scary. Great. One thing's for sure. We're not getting any more info off that thing. Well, there's always Riddler's laptop. Harley still has it. The decryptor probably works with that as well. Everything okay down there? Send the lift back up. I should have come back sooner and reeled Riddler in, but I didn't. Knowing he was tangled up with Sanctus, and what he did to Lucius, this is my fault. My mess to clean up. By yourself? I can help. Why? Do I look like I need your help? You don't have the code to do what needs to be done here, Bruce. You want to do this your way? You'll have to beat me to it. doing balancing the scales you are not leaving here with that oh honey i'm already gone resourceful as always Bye, Bruce. It's been fun. Mm. <laughs> You've gotten rusty. You haven't gotten past me yet. I forgot how skilled you are with your hands. <laughs> Awfully bold move, considering we just met, Mr. Wayne. This is flirty. Move, John.
woman, wait! Sorry, Bruce, but I'm taking Harley's laptop for myself. And I'm finishing this my way. <clears throat> Harley's laptop, huh? You and I, we're going to talk. Somewhere else. So, John, about the laptop, um... You know, I'm the first guy who'd resort to stealing from anyone, anyone but her. But in a way, that almost makes it more enticing. But in another way, maybe I tell her, getting her good graces, maybe I will. And maybe I'll do just that. Then she'd remember my name has an H in it. She always spells it J-O-N. And how do you think Harley feels about snitches? She told me to snitch. I think she likes them. Well, <laughs> maybe not. I don't know, Bruce. I'm torn here. Just thinking about her makes me feel like I'm floating. She's the most intriguing creature ever to grace me with a demeaning insult. Which is great, don't, don't get me wrong. I, I, I want more, Bruce. Like you and Catwoman. I'm only a little ashamed to say that dance had my pulse pounding. What's your relationship with her? Your real one? Catwoman and I are... What we have is a little tangled up. Oh, what I wouldn't give to be that tangled up with Harley. <sighs> if only Harley saw me. Like, really saw me. The world's a crazy place, isn't it? I want Harley, and you want the laptop. Maybe we can come to an arrangement. I help you with Harley. <laughs> <laughs> I see. You're up to bat, then, Wayne. What did you do to make Catwoman purr? How can I get that with Harley? You just need to be genuine. You're special, John. She just needs to see that. So, be myself. I hear that a lot, but how can I be myself if I don't really know who that is yet? How did you know who you are, Bruce? I've always known who I am. Something happened early on that... that made me what I am today. Oh, I hope a moment like that finds me soon. It must be great to be... who you're supposed to be. I can feel someone. A few layers deep, pacing like an animal in a cage, just looking for something to start it. The prison break. No, maybe stick with being nice until you figure it out. People appreciate kindness, even Harley. Probably. How does that even work? Bond with her. Lend a hand with a problem she has. I don't know, Bruce. I have a tough time just talking to her. Oh, I've got an idea. Let's play pretend. Uh, what? You'll be Harley. Say something Harley would say. That laptop is for my eyes only. Oh, I see what you're doing. You want to talk about the laptop, okay. But I want to talk about Harley. We made a deal. She would say something like that, though. Now, say something, uh, date-like. Like we're out painting the town red. Hi, John. I like hiking. Do you like the outdoors? Boys, you love me! So, so, 
So what do you think? Pretty good, right? Okay, so you're coming off just a little bit desperate. And women like that? No, none. Okay, hit me. Another. What was your favorite thing about Arkham, Puddin? For me, it was Sloppy Joe Fridays. Bruce! This is just uncanny. Okay, okay, here we go. I enjoyed the lights. They had a hum to them. Felt like a blanket. Fuzzy, even. I miss that on the outside. It, it doesn't feel as real here, you know? Out here, chaos seems to rule the day. It's loud and uneven. But you, Harley, you thrive on it. I could learn from that because I thrive on you. You're my light outside of Arkham. It's beautiful, John. She'll be eating out of your hand in no time. Y you think? I, I, I don't know. It, it felt weird to say. I really think I'm getting the hang of this. I'll start the next one. Your face has all the adequate face-like qualities one looks for in, uh, in a face. Harley, I lobbed you a perfect pitch. You gonna swing or what? John, sorry, something just came up. Uh, it's business. I have to run. So soon? It's, it's fine. A for effort, Bruce. I guess I won't go tattling to Harley. So, will you help me get the laptop? Gosh, Bruce. Our talk really got me fired up to find myself. My true self. Plus, your Harley is spot on. Oh, you drive a hard bargain, mister. Wait. Okay, let me mull over the logistics. But I'm in. Meet me back at the subway when you're done with your business. And because we're pals, coffee's on my dime. Bruce? <laughs>